uh, uh, so one day, uh, uh, I, I know you are still watching Obina, so I, I didn't want to say this while the phone is still on. Because if you want to tell the history of Flatu United, if you want to tell the history of how you guys abandoned playing the final after you have lost and lost and lost and lost, I see you no longer. Anyway, you started winning, Sha. So let us so talk, let's talk about the modern Plateau United. It's, it gladdens our hearts, not the other. <laughs> the other Although ones. Although Plateau at one point had the record of, you know, they, they made it to the um, final of the Governor's uh, Cup yes. in 1951. Yeah. And then they lost 13 consecutive finals. The, yes. Until they were the worst performing cup in the finals. In the world. In the world. <laughs> and, and they finally won in 1999. So. Are you hearing that, Tony? Are you hearing that? Between 51 and 99. See, yeah. between 1951 and 19. 1999. 1999, you were in the finals 13 times. Well, and then they won the 14th. Yeah, it was the 14th one that you won. Finally. I remember the one, I think it was in the, the seven, 1972. 72. 72, yeah. okay. We are still. Is it in Joss again? No. Okay, a lot of lie. Hello. Hello, hello, good morning. Good afternoon to you all. Good afternoon. Yeah. So, a supporters of Plato United. Okay. Yes, the most of which Go on. Uh, hello. Go on, go on. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you very much. I want to chip in here. Okay. Thank you about Plateau United, please. Yeah, my boss, I know uh, she say you come from Plateau State, you're based on Plateau. I appreciate that. One love, keep us together. Yeah, actually, I want to chip in about the issue of Plateau United. Actually, the fine for me is too much. I'm telling you, we are a peace ambassador and we are a peace palestato in Nigeria. Okay. We unite people and we preach peace. I'm telling you, it's just a bad element that that do this to us in the field. Please and please, I need them to do the needful for Plateau State and help them. Because I'm telling you, I'm not happy. We are not happy. We condemn it. Please let them bring us back to Plateau United and continue the doing good things in Plateau State and Nigeria. We are a peace ambassador and we unite anybody, including you, my boss there. Thank you very much. I remember peace ambassador Abdullah Iroki Boy from Plateau State. One Lord keep us together. I always stand for peace in football in Nigeria. All right. Thank you very much. Ambassador Abdullah, one love keep us together. <laughs> so you guys, those make sure that's what we are saying. I mean, like I said, one bad apple. Uh, uh, do spoil the bunch. So you, you let, let them identify those who are involved in who they have. You, you they know them. They know those who have the tendency. They know, who, you know, they, who, it's, it's not the first time some of those who are doing it. Bring them out, and then so you know you you you, you get this done. Uh, you wouldn't you wouldn't love it if you're a referee or your your friend or a brother is a referee and the both are handling and some of them lose their lives and stuff like that. This football is supposed to be uh, like you said, you're a peace. It's supposed to bring peace, and that is why uh, uh, when you still carry that. Uh, 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 fair play, a uh, fair play flag. Tro flag. He says fair play. Uh, it, so that judge does if nobody's happy, it is that for the you know for the, the ban and other uh, 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 fine they ask them to do. But we are saying, can what do we do to nip it in the bud? Because that is, this, this is a reaction. Like was, you know before that's that's what we're saying. If you, are, you keep all these fans are just reaction. What do you do to prevent it from happening? That is the issue. Uh, uh, we still would, you have a question. You know, yeah, we have problems in the house. It's also chipping something. Yeah. Um, talking about history, there was a time history was banned from the school curriculum here in Nigeria. Yeah. And uh, like two years ago, we we're talking about five million naira being budgeted for research on sport. And I said that was um, obviously uh, quite ridiculous. That just to buy pencil. <laughs> so. Um, <laughs> It was talking about getting this thing from the archiver, and I remember the 72 final you're talking about. It took uh, me to listen to Ainlaw Mowura, one of the leading musicians then, to even know about that 72 final. Yes. It was a repeat, uh, they had the repeat edition, so. All right, let's, 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 go, let's go to Endo. With... Hello? No. Ah, please, uh, it, sometimes when, when this call just drops, I don't know what to do about it. Please just do call back if you can. I know the lines, everybody want to get through, but you might be lucky to get through again. Ken, but is, yeah. is my, my own is an alluding to history, yeah. and I think we need to just right some wrong. Knowing that football started in Nigeria like 115 years ago, ago. Why are we claiming that our NFA is just them? Um, you know, you ask him from, from, you know, from, from, your, from your research. Yes. When, 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 when was the FA born? Okay, uh, we are back in the. Uh, uh, is the caller back? Oh. Paul. Hello, Paul. Hello. Okay. Uh -huh. All right, Paul, go on. Uh -huh. uh, good afternoon. I want to congratulate you. You know who knows very much about uh, Nigerian football. Go on. 
Thank you, thank you. Uh, Besides that, I want to congratulate my friend insurance. <laughs> Hello? Okay. Oh, uh, congrats, we have, we, we, uh, yeah. Insurance, congratulations. We're we being congratulating them. Go on, Paul. Congratulations, Bend Insurance. You see, uh, this coming of Bend Insurance to the Premier League is bringing a lot of good things to Edo State. Okay. If I may go down memory lane, I remember when I was in secondary school, I used to save money because I want to work Bend Insurance. Okay. Now, I think we are going to resume that. And besides that, I also congratulate the government of Edo State. You see, that must of there in reviving the spirit. There are many street, uh, um, people on the street who have no job. If you engage them in football, it is productive. It is this peace. I cannot imagine somebody who went to work football who's going to kidnap. Congratulations, my dear governor. Congratulations, those things. Congratulations, everybody. Thank you very much. Julia, congratulations, Paul. <laughs> I love that. Uh, uh, the, after we talk about the governor, we, we, we spoke to Dudu Rume last week, and then he's about the impact, the deputy governor being a part of the team, and then the revival and stuff. We, we only said, look, it would have been better uh, if that, you know, that feel good thing would have been there if uh, 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 shooting stars also were also promoted alongside Bender Insurance. So when you add them to Rangers, uh, uh, you, 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 you get back yeah, to what no, we're talking about. about so let's talk about the bet of football in Nigeria. Right. Uh, uh, the FA uh, keep on telling us that the, uh, the Nigerian Football Federation or the NFA was founded in 1945. Right. Do you agree with them? Um, absolutely not. Um, so the Lagos District Amateur Football Association, LDAFA, was the first sort of organized uh, football body in Nigeria that was organized in the 1920s. Um, in 1933, they basically had a meeting where they invited people from football associations around Nigeria um, to come to Lagos and have a meeting to start the Nigerian Football Association. Uh, it was August 1933. It happened in the medical office on Broad Street. It's today, the building is still there. It's a, um, it's a local government office now. Um, and you know, there's a newspaper report. Well, there's a newspaper announcement of the meeting. There's a newspaper report of the meeting um, and who was elected and who the officials were and all that. So w we have no idea historically why 1945 is chosen as the date it, it actually there's it's ground based on there's no reason for that you 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 you, you kind of alluded uh, in our last discussion mm -hmm. talking about mm -hmm. probably when because of when the, the first right uh, governor's uh, governorship gov right so the the original governor's cup what's now the iteo cup yeah um it's nigeria's oldest cup tournament was basically a, a trophy donated by governor arthur richards in 1945 uh, but the thing is, the first tournament was actually organized by the Lagos District, and so it wasn't even organized by the NFA. So even that is an explanation, but it also still doesn't actually make sense. Why at 1945 is the date? So whenever I buy a Nigerian jersey, I make sure it's the one that says Abuja and doesn't say 1945. As a historian, I don't want to wear something that's false.